That's all, keep on. I thank the Minister for giving way. And just further to that point about the remaining gaps in the bill, and I appreciate his point about this being a moving target, and everybody, not just in this country but around the rest of the world, is having to learn as the internet evolves. Um, I should thank him for the Government's amendment, I think it's number 241, which is dealing with what started off as a point about provenance, understanding where information that is posted on the bill, on, on, the, on the web, comes from, and allowing people, therefore, to check whether or not they want to see it if it is coming from dubious sources. That is an example of a collective harm, of people posting disinformation, misinformation online and attempting to subvert often our democratic processes, amongst other things as well. Um, I believe, and I would like to sort of park with him, if I can, the notion that we are going to have to come back to that area in particular. It is an area where the bill is particularly weak, notwithstanding all the really good stuff that it does elsewhere, notably on the areas he's been mentioning. And I think that I hope that everyone in this House will accept that this is something which will need to be revisited in due course. Minister. Uh, I thank uh, my honourable friend for that. And uh, undoubtedly, we'll have to come back on that. I think um, not everything needs to be in this bill at this point in time, as we better understand uh, uh, mis and disinformation, as we better understand the uh, deep fakes and, uh, and the proliferation uh, and repetition of fake images and fake uh, text, fake news, then uh, industry initiatives like Adobe's uh, um, uh, uh, content uh, uh, security is, 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 are really good initiatives in themselves. But as he said, we need to look at this and keep looking at this to make sure that we can stay ahead of the game. That's why we've made it flexible. Yes, I'll happily keep on. I'm grateful to the Minister.